Fresno State last year ended up in the top 25. Listen, I see Fresno State in the top 25 every single year, man. They always have a good program. You know, one of like a low ranked team, but they are always ranked, and that's all that matters, man. On this channel, I cover everybody, man. I enjoy watching Fresno State, man. Last year, you guys had this receiver. He was on another level, man. And y'all had a quarterback that was on another level too, man. Y'all always got respect, man. Fresno State is a great program, is a great team, man. Listen, y'all y'all got a very, very, very good future, man. But in this video, I got y'all top must get in the 2024 class, man. For y'all, I only had two because that's what 247 told me that you guys, you know, were interested in. So I only get prospects that you guys are interested in. And for the first prospect that I see that y'all interested in is this guy, Ryan Pilum, man, man. When I tell you this guy is a great player, man, this guy is amazing, man. He's a wide receiver, man. One of the top wide receivers in the nation, man. This guy is explosive, man. I turned on his film. The first play I seen was him kick, taking a kick return to the crib, man. When I see a receiver that could take a kick return to the crib, all I think about is explosive ability. And on Fresno State last year, y'all, when I was watching, I seen that y'all always had a somewhat explosive receiver. Now, he wasn't like that elite athlete, like oh, an Alabama receiver, Ohio State receiver. But man, y'all's receivers were pretty good and explosive for the conference y'all were playing in and grabbing this guy Ryan Pelham oh my god he hit the he hit the brakes and he is gone man I like him because he's a he has the ability to create good separation when I you know study a wide receiver that's what I like li looking at like the ability to create separation I also see they route tree. What routes they love to run? This guy, you could send him on a streak. He could get past that safety and go all the way to the crib. You feel me? Great, great, great player. You feel me? Like, um, you could actually, you know, bring him on the jet sweep. That shows his lateral quickness into explosion, you know? And this guy is physical, man. He could lay wood. He ain't scared to, you know, get down and dirty and lay it. You feel me? So, man, like, y'all grab this receiver, man. That would be a big, big, big time get, man. I'm focused on offense with Fresno State because y'all always have put a great defense on the field, you know, in a Pac-12 conference. So, on this video, I'm going to be just straight focusing on offense and how y'all could get better on offense, man. Period, point blank, man. Fresno State, man, y'all have a great future. Now, this next prospect is the last prospect that y'all have to get, man. This is a must-get prospect, man. He's an offensive tackle out of Saney and California and Brandon Baker, man. Listen, Brandon Baker is a good offensive lineman, man. Listen. This guy lays wood, man. When I tell you, man, like you, it's going to be hard to get past him. It's going to be really, really hard, man. This is the top prospect on y'all board, man. Listen, y'all need offense alignment. It's always good to have a big offense alignment that get down in the middle and work and protect that quarterback, man. This guy can do it all, man. Like his speed, his agility, the way that he can, you know, you know, make plays, the way that he can, you know, run over people. I like how he finished his block right now. Brandon Baker, he is the number 36 prospect in the country right now, <clears throat> Bro, oh my God, man. Listen, he just be mauling people. Like, I like maulers, bro. That's one thing that I do like is maulers. And he is one of those, man. Like, I would love him to be an offensive tackle for my team. My team is Ohio State. Um, but y'all, you know, y'all battling with, you know, some top programs for this prospect, man. Y'all battling Miami. Y'all battling Ohio State, Oregon, USC, all the power five programs for him. But man, if y'all could pick up this guy, man. Oh my God. Oh my God, man. He is one of those guys, man. Brandon Baker, man. He going to be the next, the next NFL draft pick, man. He is a nasty player, nasty offensive tackle. Y'all got to pick him up. Man, y'all got to pick him up, period, point blank, man. Period, point blank. And yeah, man, 
um, them are the top two prospects that I feel like y'all got to get. And I have one more prospect. I really couldn't get no film on this guy. But, man, um, you know, I've seen him play before um, down there in California, man. His name is Jordan Ross. He's the number 175th prospect in the nation, man. This guy is insane, man. His ability to create separation is insane. His route running is insane, bro. He is a great player. Right now, for him, y'all be competing with, you know, schools like Arizona State, Auburn, Colorado is really interesting. Like, prime time, he really interested in his prospect. This guy is a good, good player, man. Like, he got that dog in him. He could play two ways. You can put him on defense and offense, man. Y'all got to grab this prospect, man, too. And, yeah, man, that was that's just my NL and analysis on y'all's, you know, y'all's recruiting class for Fresno State, man. Y'all got to grab these prospects, man. Brandon Baker would be a good one. Um, Ryan Peelum, the number 50th prospect in the nation and number nine wide receiver in the nation will be a great pickup for you guys, man. Listen, man, Fresno State, y'all in the top 25, y'all should be able to grab these recruits, man. It's your boy, the Slimy Lou. Make sure y'all like up, subscribe up to the channel, man, and I'll continue to make this dope, dope content, man. I love you guys. Peace.